In this video, we will review how to manually bump test your Altair 4XR detector. To learn how to run an automated bump test, check out our Galaxy GX2 system test stand videos. To run a manual bump test, you will need a calibration check gas cylinder and an MSA quarter liter per minute flow regulator. You'll also need the calibration cap and tubing that were supplied with your Altair 4XR detector. Connect the regulator to the cylinder. Then connect the regulator tubing to the calibration cap. While the Altair 4XR detector is in normal operating mode, press the down arrow button. The resulting page alternates between bump test and expected test gas concentrations. Be sure to verify that gas cylinder concentrations match those displayed on the bump test page. Next, connect the calibration cap to the detector. To start the test, press the center button and immediately open the regulator valve to start the flow of test gas. After the bump test completes, be sure to close the regulator valve. The instrument will display either bump pass or bump error following the test. Bump pass indicates that the test passed. An on-screen check mark and green bump LED activates for 24 hours to serve as a reminder of the passing result. If bump error is displayed, the test has failed. A red bump LED activates as a result. Do not use an instrument that fails the bump test until the issue is resolved. Bump test failures often are caused by simple issues. Common causes include a calibration cap that is not seated correctly, bump test gas that has passed its expiration date, or bump test gas concentrations that do not match the instrument's bump test settings. If these issues have been verified and resolved, and the detector still fails the bump test, perform a full calibration.